designed to treat an average of 35 million gallons of water per day, Central Contra Costa Sanitary District's recently constructed Advanced Waste Treatment Plant recycles domestic sewage for use as cooling and process water for major industries in the San Francisco Bay Area. The plant features one of the world's most advanced treatment systems, combining lime clarification in the primary sedimentation tanks, biological nitrification denitrification, and a two-stage sludge conditioning process that includes lime recovery. Because of the exacting standards required for industrial water, the Central Contra Costa Sanitary District has constructed a state-of-the-art computer and instrumentation control system. The computer system consists of a network of two main computers and 25 microcomputers. 20 microcomputers receive data from almost 3,000 field instruments. The two main frame computers are programmed to actually control plant equipment such as pumps, valves, fans, motors, and circuit breakers. The computers also maintain tank levels, pump speeds, liquid and solid flow rates, and chemical dosages to the precision required by the treatment process. The plant operator is in full control of this entire system through the use of a color graphic TV console. This man-machine interface provides a simple yet effective means of communication between the operator and the computer. The sanitary district's computers use graphics in a number of ways to present information to the plant operators. One way is through the use of conventional trend recorders. A newer approach to graphics is historical plots of plant process variables. The most effective use of graphics is the display of plant schematics which represent actual plant areas. These are presented in full color on a TV screen and provide an almost effortless man-machine interface. Each TV console is equipped with a light pen and functional keyboard. The operator uses these devices to call up schematics, alter plant operations, or respond to alarm conditions. The operator can view a master schematic from which he can select any of 25 main displays. These displays correspond to the major areas within the plant. The operator can see an expanded version of a specific plant area by using the light pen to touch key target areas. Each schematic presents information by means of color-coded flags called semaphores. The semaphores represent the operating status of a piece of equipment such as on-off, ready-not-ready, or open-closed. For specific value information, the operator can touch the semaphore with the light pen. The desired information will then be written at the bottom of the TV screen. Should an upset condition occur anywhere in the plant, the computer will immediately issue an audio alarm to the operator. The operator can call up the schematic showing the environment of the alarm by pressing the display alarm button. The operator can then dispatch a crew to the alarm area. Once a decision has been made on a course of action to solve the problem, the operator, using his functional keyboard, can manually make a 1 to 10 percent correction. Should an alarm condition occur outside the building, the plant operator can personally view the location on a closed-circuit TV. Additional graphics packages are being developed for plant supervisors. Data is available to show a 24-hour history of any part of the plant. This data is converted to graphics which visually portray correlations in plant variables. Plant supervisors are able to study long-term correlations of plant processes and achieve better efficiencies in plant operations. Central Contra Costa Sanitary District's future is one of growth and expansion. The district's management will guide and develop a plant which presently reclaims 35 million gallons of water per day to one which has the capacity to reclaim 120 million gallons of water per day. The management is pledged to a philosophy of self-sufficiency in plant operation. Their goal is to develop a solid waste recovery system to produce a thermal byproduct which will provide most of the energy for the plant and the wastewater treatment process. The design philosophy of self-sufficiency includes a modern machine shop, 
maintenance shops to service and repair the sophisticated instrumentation and control system, and three well-equipped laboratories to monitor quality control at all stages of the process flow. We at the Central Contra Costa Sanitary District are justifiably proud of our new facility. We are committed to ensure that expendable resources are conserved and that renewable resources are managed to produce optimum yields. We will continue to provide the finest possible service to the residents of Contra Costa County.